If you were watching last week, you'll know that my favorite thing to put on my ricotta hotcakes is whipped maple butter. Now, this stuff is so delicious, and it's good on toast, on crumpets, on regular pancakes, and it is super easy to make, and I'm gonna show you how I do it. To start with, I have 75 grams of unsalted butter here, which is soft. Now, it doesn't wanna be like floppily soft. It needs to have a little bit of body to it. Um, and I'm gonna add one teaspoon of maple syrup. And I'm gonna use my hand mixer to mix that together for about one to two minutes until it starts to get a bit paler and fluffy. Now, I know what you're thinking, that's not enough maple syrup to make this butter mapley enough. You're right, I'm gonna put some more in, but first I'm gonna put this in the freezer for about one or two minutes to kind of firm up and chill, and that's gonna make it get even fluffier when I next whip it, so here you go. Okay, that's been chilling for a minute, and now I'm going to do the same thing again. A teaspoon of maple syrup and give it a whip. It's getting there, but I'm going to do this two more times with two more teaspoons of maple syrup. and just keep on beating that on quite a high speed until you reach a really nice, pale, fluffy consistency. All right, that is looking lovely. Silky, whippy, and tasty. So all I need to do now is pop that in a little bowl and make some pancakes. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And don't forget, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on the link at the end. And if you haven't seen my ricotta hotcakes video, you can click on the link now to see that. I'll be back on Thursday with a regular recipe, so I will see you then.